I am Asher Shunan Khan from Roswell Park Cancer Institute in Buffalo, New York. I'm here at ASH in Orlando, Florida, where we recently presented the analysis of two large studies, the 009 and 010 study, in which lenalidomide, or Revlimid, was combined with dexamethasone and compared to dexamethasone alone in a multi-center international studies. In this analysis, what we focused on was looking at whether patients who are advanced stage 65 years or, or older, in which often chemotherapy is fairly poorly uh, tolerated, we wanted to see if this particular drug, i.e. lenalidomide, is equally well tolerated and efficacious. What we found from an analysis was that when lenalidomide is added onto dexamethasone, it is equally effective as is in younger patients. Not only that, but the tolerability is also similar. Thus, age was not a negative factor in getting this particular therapy. We also noted that patients who were 65 or and above benefited in terms of durability of responses, and actually the responses and durability of responses were higher compared to the control arm. And so we concluded from our analysis that age should not be a negative factor in prescribing and taking care of patients who would want to use lenalidomide as part of their therapeutics in multiple myeloma.